Hi guys, this is Kenya. Welcome back to Kane's Decor Corner. So today is part two in my huge summer haul series. And today I'll be showing you guys items that I've thrifted. So everything that you'll see in this video are items that I found at the Goodwill. And so let's get started. Now I guess I'll start, I'll start right here first. I got this beautiful cross. Look at how large this cross is guys. This piece is so large. It's absolutely beautiful. And I don't know where it's from, but the original price tag is on here. You can see the original price was $29.99. And you can also see that I got it for $7. So that's more than I would normally pay for anything at the thrift store or at the Goodwill. But because this is such a large piece, and you can see how beautiful it is with all the detailing that I just had to get it. This is going to be a beautiful addition to my cross wall. So that's why I got that. Guys, please disregard the drumming in the background. Addison is playing on his drums. You guys already know every Saturday, that's what he do. He plays his drums. He plays his drums every day. But Saturday morning, he's going hard on the drums. So forgive the noise. <laughs> um, the next piece I got is also another cross. And this one um, was, I don't know if you guys can see that, it was $3.99, so $4. You can see the Roman numerals there. And so, yeah, the, um, these were not the extra percentage off this time either, which I was like, oh, well, I like the crosses. You guys know I collect crosses, and so I like to find them at thrift stores and places like that because usually I get a good price on them. And even though this one was kind of pricey, it's still nice because it's very large. So, and you can see the regular price was $30. So to get it for $8 is fair. Or $7. How much was it again? Yeah, $6.99 for $7. That's a fair. That's a good deal. And so this one was $3.99. Now this is a metal cross. And I love, you guys can see here, how it's like a kind of greenish color. And it's got gold on it too. It's like distressed with gold. So kind of like gold foil, you can see that there. So pretty, and I love the medallion in the center. And so, yeah, I was really excited to find this piece. So it will also be added to my cross wall. Very pretty. And let's see here, I, I've gotta open this piece. I got these beautiful fall plates. And I know there's a little bit of a glare. I apologize for that. I'm going to hopefully you can see the price. Probably not. Maybe a little bit. $1.99. I paid $1.99 for these two beautiful fall leaves. And I should have brought some scissors over here. I didn't think about it. But they just have it wrapped in like this um, like clean wrap. And so for two of these for $2, that's a dollar each for these beautiful plates. So I was so excited to find them. Oh, hopefully I don't break it before I get to show you guys. <laughs> so this is the yellow one. Look at how pretty that is. It has a little detailing on the bottom here. And you can see all the um, veining work in the leaf. They're so pretty. This is so pretty. And it just says leaves on the back of it. Um, so I don't know like what company made them or whatever, but it's very beautiful. Uh, you could probably hang it if you wanted to, but I'm going to probably use these as like a candy dish or something like that for fall. But I thought that was so pretty and a great price. And so here's the orange one. Again, it has the little, same little hook here on the bottom. Just so pretty. Very pretty for the fall. You guys know I love decorating in the traditional colors for the fall, but this year... I'm going to add a little twist, and so if you guys want to see how I decorate for the fall, be sure to come back, because you already know I'm going to show you guys room by room a home tour of my fall decor. And so these two pieces were a beautiful addition. I also got these beautiful pillows. Look, guys, I've never seen a jute twine pillow before, but this pillow is made of jute twine, and it has a little tag on here. It was regular priced at $54.95. Some place, some store, somewhere was selling this pillow for $54.95. Uh, 
and you can see how it has a little tassel details on it around the edge of it it's a beautiful pillow it has a zipper back so you can remove the um, you can unzip it here and remove the pillow cover to clean it if you need to so you can see it unzips there like that and so yeah really nice great quality you can see the detailing around the band here it's like a braided um, area of basket woven type very very pretty so I got this at the thrift store for two dollars and ninety five cents if you can see that two dollars and ninety nine cents excuse me two ninety nine for this beautiful pillow now I will say I was sad to find that they only had this one with this detailing on it with the, um, the little tassels hanging on it they only had one but I took it I thought that was a great price it is in impeccable condition you can see how it's in great condition but as a precaution I always um, let them sit out in the sun to sun out and then I spray it with Febreze and so yeah and it's likely I'll probably use them outside but um, I likely will use them in my home as well so I've cleaned them so yeah no worries there and then but they did have these also and look at this one so cute it's also a jute twine pillow and this one is made by a company called mud pie do you see that there mud pie pillows and so um it does not have the original price on the tag but you can see here it also says mud pie there so these pillows are made by the company mud pie and i don't know what the original price is i should have looked it up um, to see like google it but at any rate, I got it for $1.99. I'm sure this pillow cost more than $1.99 from Mud Pie. So I thought this was a great buy. Again, in excellent condition. Excellent, excellent condition. They're like brand new. They're brand new pillows. They have the tags on and everything. So I got um, seven of these pillows. So I really wish they had eight because I now I've added the leaf to my dining room table. So now we have a seating of eight instead of six but um at any rate i took the seven and i'll use this one to complete my setting if i were going to use it at my dining room table for eight so great looking pillows great condition and great price so i was excited to find those i also got this beautiful basket you can see it's very large it's a hand woven basket and you can see the detail work on the inside there just absolutely beautiful just a beautiful piece and this piece was here we go it was two dollars and 99 cents i don't know if you can see the tag there but you can see they wrote on the basket the little um three dollars there the hashtags there so three dollars for this large beautiful basket and so I am going to be using this for the fall um, and for Christmas and then for spring also, I'm sure. But for the fall, I'm going to fill it with some blankets and pumpkins or something like that. So I thought this was so pretty. I absolutely love the detail work in it. You can see that there. And it has these handles on here. You can see how they're attached. Again, these are hand woven. Absolutely beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful basket. And you know guys they always have great baskets at the um, goodwill and other thrift stores but i try not to get them because i don't want to go basket crazy and have a lot of baskets everywhere because i could totally do that but whenever i find a beautiful one like this i try to take it and so i was excited to get that piece okay and then we're winding down here i have a few more items I found this beautiful, and this is by, what does that say, Harvey? Hmm. I don't know because I can't really read it, but if you guys can see that there, you can't see it. I'll have to try to figure that out and look at it closely, but this beautiful pumpkin, it's so beautiful. And I got it for $5.99. And so um, you can see here on the bottom, they wrote $6 on there. So I got this beautiful pumpkin for six dollars, and it says it's a um, it says the perfect autumn pumpkin scented candle. Scented candle? What? 
Okay, I'm gonna have to find some scissors so that I can open this to see if it's a candle or if it's a pumpkin. I won't be opposed to if it's a candle, but I was hoping that it would be just a pumpkin with the lid on it so that I can add, you know, candies to it and um, other little treats for my guests when they come over. But let me see here. I've almost got it off. Sorry, guys, that I didn't have this open already, but I didn't know I was going to try to open it. I thought it was just a pumpkin with a lid. I didn't know. So now I want to see if it's a candle. Oh, it is a candle. Oh, that kind of sucks. Oh, it smells pretty. It smells good, but it is a, it's a four wick candle. Okay. It's got a nice pumpkin-y smell, <laughs> if that's a word, pumpkin-y. <laughs> um, it's got a nice pumpkin smell. Four wick candle, as you can see that there. It's a little bit heavy. Um, really pretty pumpkin. I will have to decide if I'm gonna burn this or not. Um, I probably will since it is a pumpkin, but nonetheless, I'll definitely sit it out. Um, but yeah, a beautiful piece, beautiful pumpkin, and it's by, let me see if I can read that again. It's by Harry something or other. Let's see here. Is that Harvey Schlacken? S-L-A-K-I-N? I don't know, something like that. Harvey Slacken something. Yeah, by the Slacken Company. That's what it says, Slacken and Company, Broadway, New York. Hmm, I'm gonna have to Google this to see how much this regularly would cost. And if you guys are familiar with this brand, Slacken and Company, Slatkin, Slatkin, S-L-A-T-K-I-N, Slatkin and Company. If you're familiar with their, um, with their candles, then let me know. This is a beautiful pumpkin candle. I'm probably going to go ahead and use it as a candle. It's really pretty. I bought it because it was a beautiful pumpkin. You guys know I love pumpkins. I love to collect pumpkins. And so I have a huge pumpkin collection. And that's going to be added to my collection. So I was excited to find that. And then I also got two more pieces that were a great find as well. I'm going to Google that company to see what their pumpkins normally retail for. But if you guys are familiar, leave it in the comments down below and let me know what the going price is for a Slatkin and Company pumpkin candle. <laughs> okay, now also I did find this beautiful little tomato terrine. And so it's, um, I did, and this is by Staub, S-T-A-U-B, Staub. And I did Google these and they have these at like, um, West Elm and William Sonoma, or stores like that. Maybe it wasn't West Elm. Maybe it was William Sonoma. Um, for thirty dollars, and I got it for five dollars and ninety nine cents. So that was a great price for this piece, and it's in perfect condition. Absolutely perfect condition. There's no, there's no dings on it, anything anywhere. It's just absolutely perfect. Beautiful little dish. And you can cook with these. You can put this in the oven. I did do a little bit of research on it while I was in the Goodwill to decide if I wanted to pay $5.99 for this piece. Because at first I thought, I'm paying $5.99 for this huge pumpkin. Why would I pay $5.99 for this little tomato? And I so, but I figured the name Stop sounded familiar to me. And so I Googled it and that's when I saw the price um, that they normally retail for. And some of the bigger ones go for obviously even more. But this is what they had at the Goodwill. And so I took it, um, thought it was a great price, and that it was in impeccable condition. Like normally the stem will be broken or something. Absolutely beautiful, perfect condition. So I got that. Um, and then I also got, so because I don't have a set of those guys, I would normally, because you can cook with these in the oven, you could put like, you could make like a little, dish in it and then roast it in the oven and take it out of the oven and serve it just like that um so i thought this was so neat and but because i only have one i'm gonna likely use it as like a little candy dish or something like that but i thought it was so pretty so i took it and then last but not least i did find this beautiful little stop pumpkin dish and so, yeah, they don't have the lid on here, right? But they taped it down. 
and you can see it's in again perfect condition absolutely perfect there's no dings on it anywhere the stem is in place and it's by the stop company so yeah i was so excited to find that and they had it also for $5.99 so i took it and so yeah again i'll use these for my, during the fall i'll have these out you will see them somewhere <laughs> so um yeah i was so excited to get these super cute items so that is it for this haul i hope you guys have enjoyed it and if so be sure to give me a thumbs up like the video leave me some comments down below let me know what you guys think let me know what you guys think also about these i think these were the fabulous find of the day even though they were a little pricey at six dollars each i thought they were a great price because they normally retail for triple that amount so i am so happy to find those and of course really i guess these had to be the most fabulous find of the day the best find of the day because for two dollars for these two beautiful leaves like you can't beat that you can't beat that price so that's probably the best price of the day but at any rate leave me a comment down below let me know what you guys like the most and if you're new to my channel welcome i'm so happy to have you here i hope that you'll go ahead and click that subscribe button and also the notification bell so that you'll be alerted as to when I upload new videos. And if you are my faithful family members, thank you guys. Thank you for all of your love and support. I really, really appreciate it. And I look forward to seeing you on the next video. Much love and many blessings. Bye-bye.